Greetings to you all, and welcome back to Let's Play Conan Conquer Tiberian Sun. I reloaded the game, and the graphical artifacts are dealt with. Wonderful. And if you're wondering why I'm having crashes, and things like the menu disappearing when I save, and graphical issues, it's not because there's something wrong... It's not because there's something wrong with the free downloadable version of Tiberian Sun from CNCNet. It's because I have configured it to run as close to classic settings as possible. So I'm using a draw mode that you wouldn't normally use on Windows 10 in order to get the full screen 800 by 600 resolution. If I didn't do that, you would be able to see for miles, like four times as much on the screen and the sidebar would be enormous. You'd have about 20 icons per per line instead of seven. And that's, that's a better way to play. Strategically speaking, it's better. You have more information, you have more options available with less input. So it's good. And if you want to play online against other players, you should definitely, definitely play the essentially HD version. But I wanted that authentic experience like it was back in 99, 2000, whenever I played this game. I mean, I got it when it came out. I can't remember. I think it was 99. Unit ready. Cloak unit detected. So, yes, basically I'm using an outdated draw mode that doesn't work very well with Windows 10, and that's causing some bugs and crashes here and there. But there's nothing actually wrong with the game. If you were to play it on the current settings, the default settings, you wouldn't have these issues. So don't worry about that. Go download it, go play it. I put a link to the free download in every video. Enjoy. Anyway, on with the battle. These guys are the champs of my army. And you know it's only a matter of time until I hit another artillery. And it's time to call for backup once again. You know what? Rather than lose my whole army to it, why don't I just bomb it? In fact, I'm going to destroy these. Why is it wiggling through the air? It did go for the Vulcan cannon. Building. Construction complete. Unit ready. All right, it doesn't care. In that case, everything's going to be Vulcan cannons going forwards. This is going to be more out here. Luckily, they don't decide to bomb this. You just do me a favor and blow all of that up. Construction complete. I just instinctively tried to shift click. Does that actually do anything? No. Right. Those tanks don't actually do anything. They're not a proper nod unit. They're just a... A doodad. That's what I'd call it from StarCraft. Um... They're just a, a detailing, just an aesthetic added in for the campaign. Doesn't actually have any function. Why, hello, collector of weeds. I think we might set up shop here for a little while. You don't mind? Considering the mission warned me about the new fighter prototypes. I feel like they attacked me once, I blew them out the sky with two Sams, and then that was it, they just never bothered ever again. They don't seem to have rebuilt the things, they're not defending with them at least. I had one dumper truck down. Unit ready. 
Just park in here to destroy this other weed whacker. Now will that stop the missiles? So who wants to explore whether or not there are more obelisks waiting for us? I don't want to sacrifice one of my disruptors, but I should. It was the correct choice, because I only have limited anti-air. Another stealth generator could be anything over here, then. Well, tell you what, let's deal with it the way we're supposed to. If you've got stealth, let me bring the thing that can detect stealth. As much as I do, like, blind bombing. I suppose with, we could try and triangulate the center of the stealth based on what is and isn't cloaked. And then maybe we could bomb the center. How's that for an advanced strategy? Don't worry, we're not actually going to do that. That would require brain power. My harvesters are not harvesting the most efficient patches of Tiberium. There's blue over here. What are we dealing with? Yes, yes, yes. There's going to be cloaked unit units ready. everywhere. That's the point. Alright, calm yourself, Eva. Please stop announcing that. So ominous. Cloak unit detected. Cloak unit detected. Unit it's a repair vehicle. Cloak How are you doing? Detected. Cloak unit detected. Cloak unit detected. Cloak unit detected. Right, well we can see the stealth generator, so... This won't be a problem for much longer. Cloak unit detected. Cloak unit detected. Unit ready. Cloak unit detected. Cloak unit detected. Cloak unit detected. Insufficient funds. Cloak unit detected. Group one. Cloak unit detected. Inward. I heard subterranean movement. But it might just be some of the stuff in this base repositioning rather than an actual attack. Is that a missile or no? Eva will not shut up. Why has my opponent built nothing but subterranean APCs? Was he so impressed with how well it did in the previous mission where he nearly beat me with one engineer attack? Is it because I used pavement? Perhaps the game is scripted to attack you with subterranean APCs. And because I pavemented, he couldn't attack, and so he just gave up and left them here. Maybe. Cloaked unit detected. Okay, there's another. There's another uh, stealth generator back here. You are now part of group one as well. Can you just find a way to kill some of these? There's going to be a lot of friendly fire here, don't worry about it. Cloak unit detected. 
I've got you in your little Club secret unit missile bay. Unit lost. Club unit detected. Club unit detected. Club unit detected. Not the way I play so cautiously and safely. Unit it's the fighter lost. thing. I don't know its name. I've forgotten it. Club unit detected. We shall call it the prototype fighter. Unit lost. All right, that thing will kill Club us over time. Detected. So let's actually see unit what we can what we can do damage-wise while we're here. Club unit detected. Club unit detected. Club unit detected. Base under attack. My base? Club unit detected. Oh, hello. Unit you suddenly remembered you had them. I Sometimes I forget my units too, don't worry. Happens to the best of us. Stop biting me! But you are my friend! Unit lost. Club unit detected. Unit I'll just leave Club this here, I hope they don't mind. Unit ready. Club unit detected. Club Club unit detected. Oh, it's an adult. That's why it's biting Club me. Unit detected. Now look at this thing. Look, he's helping me. Ready. I mean, he's kind of helping me. He's Club also kind of hurting detected. me. He's giving them power back, which is bad, but he doesn't Club know that. As far as he knows, he's just saving me time for later. Now I don't have to go around destroying fence posts. Let's get the bombers in there. Destroy some power. Always good. I think in mass, disruptors are probably not the answer. In small numbers, disruptors are amazing. I've decided. But in mass, I need something that doesn't have friendly fire. We lost a bomber! That's not suspicious in the slightest. Guys? So they decided you hate those walls? You know, I'm going to be glad when this thing dies. Alright, new control group one. Unit ready. Why is my bomber building so slowly? I don't know, men exploded. I guess if you put sound through at the right frequency, they would. Oh dear, this thing, he can't, he can't see the enemy. Watch out. Cancelled. Unit ready. Sir. Two bombers, one of them being half dead. Ready. Insufficient funds. Try it, man. Unit ready. That's an interesting strategy. Unit ready. I wasn't watching, did they do it? I think they destroyed it, because I think he stood where the obelisk should be. But I'm not certain. It's alright, we got a mobile sensor array coming. That looks like an artillery. Or a SAM site. More likely a SAM site.
All right, Eva. Tell me. Unit detected. Cloaked unit detected. It's a shame. I was hoping that thing would be dead. Well, I got such a big army, we could just march Cloaked in there, right? Detected. Surely. Surely. Cloaked unit detected. Unit lost. Cloaked unit detected. Unit lost. Again, my disruptors are doing more harm to the friendly units than anything else. Cloaked unit detected. Building. Cloaked unit detected. I want to know what's inside that suspicious looking pen. I'm guessing it's the construction yard. I will never know! Cloaked unit detected. Cloaked unit detected. Unit ready. Ah, let's just bum rush it. What was I even afraid of? Guys, attack the units that fight back. See, now I get the feeling I may have misremembered something, because disruptors clearly have friendly fire. I know they do. But maybe not to each other. So maybe mass disruptors and nothing else is a viable strategy. Could be a thing. Someone will correct me. Someone would have corrected me in the previous video. Unfortunately, I recorded these in kind of a block. Let's get rid of this damn thing, it's annoying. Why do you have so many stealth generators? Alright, not what have you got? Just start attacking things at random, guys. I think they went a little crazy with the amount of power they built. Good lord, it's worse than I thought. Power the whole Nod War effort with this lot. No amount of leaving up laser fencing was going to do anything. Progress. It feels like this mission's over. It feels like we've won. Oh, I just don't know what happened to that aircraft. Did we destroy them all? I genuinely don't know. Destroying all of the missile launchers was never going to happen. Targeting the uh, the bulldozers was certainly the play. To stop the missile attacks. It's a strange mission, lads, but there is something up there. Can you kill it for me? Fingers, fingers crossed there's nothing on that. Okay, that's kind of funny. So, Nod, in their infinite wisdom, built these very strong anti-vehicle prototype craft. Sent them out to attack me. Whilst they were attacking me, decided it was going to build some of its inferior, weaker pea shooter craft. Because it built new units, they immediately and automatically get placed onto the helipad, which means the prototypes couldn't land and couldn't rearm. And the computer, being a computer, didn't realise this was going to happen, and so it didn't think to build some more helipads. 
And as such, the weak helicopters are now blocking the strong. Wonderful. This is what we're up against. Uh, you guys who don't die to this stuff, just go and check that that's all clear up there for me. Let's see how it went down. I mean, kind of, except it wasn't... That's not too far off what happened, I suppose. I should have shown them flying back in there, seeing new helicopters parked in their space, and then swearing over the intercom. And then just landing on the floor out in the open. That would have been more accurate. But hey ho, whatever gets the job done. Nice. That's going to do it for this video, and that's going to do it for GDI. We're going to be switching back over to Nod for a couple of missions. Uh, just to be clear, it's, we're not done on GDI, we'll be coming back. But for a while, we're going to switch over to Nod and help out Kane for a little bit. Hopefully you'll join me for that, and I shall see you then.